So right now we are turning into Petco. I have deja vu. This is like, we just did this. That was nighttime. I see the kitten. She looks okay. Hi, <laughs> look at how much is that kitten in the window? Let's go in. Here we are again. <laughs> you want to put your Hi. <laughs> How's she doing? Uh, Wheezy. She's sneezing snot all over herself. I hear her breathing. She's. We've okay. cleaned her face up a couple of times. Hi. Um, they brought her in this co Mr. Coffee box. Sweet. Brought oh. kitten to Petco. Left with thanks. Uh, this eye looks a little bit red. It's got some irritation by it. Yeah. Um, the other one seems a little better though. I'm mostly worried about um, her but the breathing. To breathe. Nope. There's the. And the sketchies. Okay. Can I? Yeah, absolutely. Hi. It's okay. Oh, hi. She's like eight weeks. Yeah, that, I saw her and I figured she was at over six. She might. She might be a he. There's a lot of fur between the genitals and the butt. Okay. That's his testicles. Ah. Wait, so yeah. it's a boy? It's a boy. Yeah. Got a boy. Yeah. yeah. He looks a little better than I was expecting, but he feels thin. He nuzzles a lot. Oh my god. Yep. You're so sweet. He's, I got here and I called Elena. I was like, so do you think Hannah's going to kill me if I tell her I have another kid for her? And Elena was like, she's a sucker. She's and I was like, call her. <laughs> just be a really bad upper respiratory infection. So we want to get him hydrated. We want to get him warm. We want to give him an antibiotic. I mean, hopefully he will be feeling better in a couple days. He won't be feeling better right away. But the thing is, if he doesn't get on an antibiotic, it will just keep getting worse. He's really beautiful. So this little guy has a really bad upper respiratory infection. I can tell because he's wheezing. You can hear all of his breathing and he's got a really, really crusty nose. So the first thing I'm gonna do is just try to clear some of these external boogers off. You just wanna be careful, of course, never to totally cover their nostrils because then they won't be able to breathe. So just quickly wiping. All right, so his nose is clear now. So this little guy is so small and thin that his dose is really, really tiny. So he is going to get 0 0.03 milliliters of doxycycline, which looks like this. Oh, you're so nice. Nobody likes getting medication, but not so bad, right? Baby, we just gotta breathe in that saline, buddy. Okay, Beans. Have a nice life! <laughs> you did so good! I'm proud of him. He was such a mess when he got here. Seriously was like bone thin, mm -hmm. couldn't breathe. He was like sunken in yeah. and now he's like this fat glorious cat. That's probably why he eats so freaking much because yep. he's like making up for lost time. So thank you for giving him a good home. Oh, thank you I'm very happy for you.